And so our story begins. But who is the hero of our tale? Then let his destiny unfold. That's lucky. Like finding a four-leaf clover. Oh, look, little sparrow. Castle Fairfax looks so nice in the snow. Imagine the grand dining hall. I bet Lord Luth... But he must be really lonely since his wife and his little girl died. In that big castle, all by himself. If only we could live there. What is going on over there? Come with me, little brother. Hello there, young Rose. You look hungry. Have you reconsidered my offer? We'll never be that hungry. The answer is no. You'll be back, and I'll be waiting for you. That filthy creep. I hate him. Oh, he's just a trader. I can't see anything past this lot. A ladies and a gentleman. I have traveled the land, accumulating wondrous and mysterious objects, which I now offer to you for the modest... Consider this. This is truly a magical mirror. For as long as you look into it, it will make you beautiful. I'll take it. Very wise. Now, just remember, the magic only works if you look at it in complete darkness. Ah, now this is truly a marvel. This small, unassuming box is actually a device creating cells. <laughs> Turn the handle three times and you shall be granted a single... There's no such thing as magic. Hey, no shoving. We live in grim times indeed. If the young are too well... Most children your age believe eagerly. Look, I can see your eyes are bad. But I'm telling you, that music box... That's what the seller thinks. He has no idea what he stumbled upon. But you... Some part of you wants to believe it's magic. What? You... You really think it could be? For five gold coins, you could have your answer. For five gold coins, we could eat for a week. Listen to me, Rose. At the end of that week, you and your little sparrow would be no closer to your dream, no closer to the inside of that beautiful castle. What if it is real? I bet we could get five gold pieces, and maybe this could be a way out. What is there to lose, little sparrow? Come on, there must be someone around here who'll pay us gold to do something. Oi, kids, come here a minute. Hello, Derek. Lose something? My arrest warrants blew right out of my hand. The warrants blew off in that direction. Through the alley by that bloke with a pi- So, we look out for those warrants. But for now, let's find some more- Astonish your friends and relatives with a lifelike in- Has he stolen anyone's soul? Now, yeah. all you have to do is strike a pose for my little device. You'll be... Very well. Strike a pose, my young friend. I'll stand here all day, me. Nothing better to do. Uh, anytime you're ready, children. <gasps> Wondrous. 
This thing's gonna be more popular than that pop. <laughs> now, I just have to wait three months for the picture to developify, and I can start showing it around. Oh, I can almost smack. Let Easy me know money if for you us. Find the warrants. He's a bit scary. Hope he's alright. We got our first gold coin though. This must be the alley the warrants blew down. We should take a look. <laughs> Come on! Rick caught a dog! Oh, what's the matter, Poochie? Does it hurt? Hey! What the hell are you doing? Having a bit of fun. What's it to you? Oh. He hit a girl. Yeah, and now I'm gonna hit another one. For your help. I could have taken him though. You fight like a hero or something. That was the best fight ever. Glad to be that wreck. He deserved it. Oh, poor thing. You've had a horrible time. Don't be scared. It won't hurt you. What you need is someone nice to look after you. Oh, no. oh we can't keep you. We don't have enough food for ourselves. Well, I'm sorry, but we can't. Now you just rest. <laughs> Rubbish! <laughs> Come on, little sparrow. Let's go. That's one there. Need help with something? Shoot the beetles. Shoot to kill. And while you're breaking their hateful little heads open... Hey, kid. Balthazar owes some protection money to get the nickname. How about to leave the people and smash the stock up? Great stuff, kid! <laughs> Great work, kid. You got a real t That'll teach Balthazar not to pay Nicky the nickname. Here, catch. I'm ruined. My stock is destroyed. That was a laugh, wasn't it? Getting paid to smash things up. And we've got another gold coin. It's my money. We're really doing it. I can it. do what I want with it. Hey, look at that, Betty. Two sets of twins. Oh, you'll get my booze back, won't you? So you'll bring me back my bottle? Yes. Oh, no. You'll find it and bring it to me, won't you, children? Let's find this magpie guy. There's that dog again. Want a drink? Hey, you found I'll not one discuss for us. it. Good boy. Oh, I know. You're sweet. But I told you before, we can't keep you. Come on, little sparrow.
Yes, another warrant. Hmm. I don't think they'll miss this Leroy if they see him. Want a drink? I'll not discuss it. Looks like a warrant, doesn't it? A friend would get an old man his drink back. Out of friendship. I won't let you slowly kill yourself. Wait! Why do you say slowly? Would you let... Only one more warrant left to find. Keep your eyes open. That must be Magpie. And there's the bottle. Get it, little sparrow, but don't wake him up. <sighs> ah, stupid Pete. You snooze, I take... Let's go collect our gold from the lady and the tramp. The quadruplets are back. Hand over the wine, little sparrow. Hand it over. Don't. He's trying to quit. Hold it. What you bang this in there for? This must be yours. Ah, I've got it. You should be ashamed of yourself. Getting children to fetch alcohol for you. He looks happy. Suppose that's what matters, isn't it? And that's three gold coins now. Just two more and we can buy the box. That's all the warrants. We should go back to that guard. <laughs> hey, it's my favorite couple of kids. Listen, creep. I told you no this morning. Hand over those warrants. There's a gold piece in it for you. Where do you think you're going? Have you found them? Thanks. You're a lifesaver. Now, normally, justice is its own reward, but as these aren't normal circumstances, here's your gold piece. That just sort out this town. Four gold coins. We just need one more. Shh. I think Mother heard us. You again? I don't want you sniffing around my daughter. Now push off. Before I call the guards, you animal! Get in the house, Belinda. And clean those floors. They're as filthy as that no-good delinquent... What's the matter with you? You! Get that letter straight to Belinda. Don't let her mum get it. <laughs> This letter's awful. Listen to this. Darling, <laughs> run away with me, like a breeze, to soar above the world in our bliss. Yeah. I said, oh, It's a bit over the top, isn't it? Oh, I'm getting too old for this racket. Knock on the door and let's see who answers. What do you want? Oh, um, we, we've got a letter. We need one gold for the post. Oh, well, why didn't you just say so? Come on in.
wait there while I get the money. And don't you touch anything. Oh, Monty told us not to give it to the mother. But she'll pay us if we just wait here. Oh, but this then, is if wonderful. If we give it to Belinda upstairs, maybe Here's they can something run away for your together. trouble. Oh, Monty, my little dove. I don't know. You've put these things somewhere so no one can find them. I guess some people's wishes do come true. We did it. We can buy the music box now. Come on, let's go buy that music box. Let's see what it can do. Belinda, what are you doing? Get back in the house. I'm leaving, Mother. I'm going to marry the man I love. Now, what? whatever you do, don't give Belinda's mum the letter. Oh, Monty, I love you. No, you don't! He's poor! <laughs> I'll never make sure if Hello, children! Hello. We've come to buy the music box. Very wise, little ones. Go ahead and turn the handle, but mind you go somewhere quiet like. Let's go make our wish, little sparrow. I wish, I wish. Yeah. 